Hello and welcome to Magpie Maker once again. I went to Lidl today to buy a bag of potatoes. But when I got there, I bought this instead. It's a welder. It's a flux cord wire welder. Product number PFDS 120A2. And I'm going to do an unboxing of this today. The package contains 0.45 kilograms of welding wire, a burner nozzle, four welding nozzles, a welding protection shield, and a chipping hammer with a wire brush. Okay, let's open the box and see what's in it. So that's the wire brush. The instruction booklet. The mask. This wee package here has got the glass lens for the mask. So on the front of the welder we have the on off switch here, we have the wire feed here and we have the amperage on this side. So we'll just open up the welder and see what it looks like inside. So inside we have three nozzles here. We also have another nozzle in the torch itself. These sizes are 0 0.6, 0 0.8, 0 0.9 and 1 mil. And there's a roll of welding wire fitted as well. This is a 0 0.9 um, of a mil welding wire and that's a 4.5 kg reel. Now to fit the wire we have to undo the tensioner and I'm just going to check the pulley or the drive wheel here. The drive wheel has two grooves in it and also has a square drive in the, in the centre. Um, it also has two grooves in it. It has a fine groove for the 0.6 and a slightly deeper groove for the 0 0.8, 0 0.9 and 1 mil. Okay, so we're going to be putting the 0.9 so we will want to keep this heavier groove to the upper side. So we fit that in like so. So we'll just fit this roll of flux core wire. So it goes through here. And as soon as you start to get it to feed in close the tensioner. Then we'll turn on the machine.
Now, whenever I pull the torch, it's going to feed the wire through. So what you want to do is try and keep the cable as straight as possible for to allow the wire to feed through. Bingo! So we just put the shroud back on again. I'm going to take this machine for a wee test to see what it welds like.
As you can see from the demo, it is a capable wee welder. It, it welded a very strong joint and I did hit it as hard as I could with the hammer. It actually buckled the steel but the weld didn't break. So it is, it is a capable welder. I am very impressed. Very impressed with the power of it. The standard flux core welding wire seems to be 0.9 of a millimeter. That seems to be the standard size for them. So if you're if you're starting off in the world of welding, for under ninety pounds you can have this machine, and I would highly recommend it to get you started. And it's much more fun than a bag of potatoes. If you liked the video, please share, like, and subscribe. And until the next time, thank you very much for watching.